Hey guys, what's going on? It's Steve Cronin. Time for something a little different this time. It's a book review. Haven't done one of these in a while. In fact, I have not done one of these since I started this new series about biohacking, quantified self, nootropics, etc. So, I am only doing this book review though because I think that if you're interested in smart drugs at all, you should definitely own a copy. This is coming up. This video is in full compliance of YouTube's community guidelines. I do not promote dangerous or illegal activities, and this video does not support illegal drug use, nor provide any medical advice. The purpose of this video is of education and to document my own personal experience. No drugs are shown within this video. All right, dude, so the book is Smart Drugs and Nutrients by Dr. Ward Dean, and this was actually written in 1990, so it's extremely old, but it's like the best resource in print, at least, about smart drugs and nootropics that I have personally found. What does this mean? Well, this actually means that there might be a pretty decent market out there if anyone wants to write a book about smart drugs that knows what they're talking about, of course, right? Like, some goof like me, uh, if I were to ever write a book, it'd be about my own subjective experiences. It wouldn't be anything like this, written by a physician. Uh, and I'll explain to you what I mean. So, this book, A, is cool because it goes through tons of smart drugs. Stuff we have already talked about on this channel, like paracetam, for example, aniracetam. Oxyracetam. There's probably like 20 different smart drugs, and then they say like nutrients as well because uh, they review other things as well, like ALC, for example. Uh, it's just different supplements that might not necessarily be considered a smart drug by today's definition, or apparently the definition of the 1990s. The reason this book is cool is because it goes through these smart drugs and it'll tell you exactly how, or at least exactly how we think, because we don't know for sure, how each smart drug is thought to affect the brain. So, for example, here is the Paracetam page, right? So there's a Paracetam page and it'll tell you exactly how, what neurotransmitters it affects, it'll give you cool charts and graphs and data points to kind of like Really, you can theoretically think about this stuff like, okay, like, you know, raises acetylcholine, I know what acetylcholine does, I know what this neurotransmitter does, this will give you, like, more of a more visual cue, so you can, like, it's really cool just to kind of, like, read a book about this stuff rather than watching videos or, like, reading descriptions on websites for all day, because that's kind of generally where I get my information from, other than, of course, just actually using the products and the reporting my subjective experience. The other cool thing is, because this is written by a physician, he can actually say in here like recommended dosages and like precautions like warnings side effects for you guys this is not something i can do right like i'm not a professional with this stuff yeah i've been taking smart drugs for several years but i'm just one dude uh who like reports his subjective experiences right i can't make any claims like this guy can in this book so it's super helpful to go through a list of 20 different smart drugs from a scientific md you know physician's perspective Flip to the smart drug you want, look at what neurotransmitters affects, it affects, and then see what the subjective effects might be, what the studies say the subjective effects are or could be or have the potential to be, right? And then, of course, get a recommended dosage from a physician and then uh, look at, like, the precautions you should take or the potential side effects from a physician. So, if you are into biohacking or self-experimentation at all, definitely pick this up. I got it on Amazon for like four bucks. Um, of course, I have Amazon Prime, so it might be a little more expensive. Uh, but this is very obviously a used copy, right? Like you can see, well, maybe you can, but you can see this like, piece of tape right here over the binding. So um, I didn't buy this book used, guys. This is a like reference, uh, but I went ahead and just read through it because it was awesome material. That's it, dudes. There is a sequel. A sequel was written to this book, and I'm gonna be talking about that later. Take care, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Subscribe to this channel. If you want more uh, reviews on smart drugs, wearable technologies, biohacking information, uh, stuff on the quantified self movement, uh, so stay tuned. Take care.